We're getting quite a bit of inaccurate news. They supply our drugs, but they don't make them here. Uh, they're getting away with murder. Uh, pharma. Pharma has a lot of lobbies, a lot of lobbyists, and a lot of power. We don't bid properly, and we're going to start bidding. And we're going to do that with a lot of other industries. And we're going to have some competition, and it's going to be a beautiful thing. We have great talent, tremendous talent. As far as hacking, I think it was Russia, but I think we also get hacked by other countries and other people. When we lost 22 million uh, names and everything else that was hacked recently, they didn't make a big deal out of that. That was something that was extraordinary. That was probably China. The Democratic National Committee was totally open to be hacked. They did a very poor job. They could have had hacking defense, which we had. And they tried to hack the Republican National Committee, and they were unable to break through. We have to do that for our country. It's very important. Do you honestly believe that Hillary would be tougher on Putin than me? Does anybody in this room really believe that? Give me a break. I think it's a disgrace. That information that was false and fake and never happened got released to the public. As far as BuzzFeed, which is a failing pile of garbage, writing it, I think they're going to suffer the consequences. They already are. And as far as CNN going out of their way to build it up, Michael Cohn is a very talented lawyer. He's a good lawyer in my firm. So all night long, it's Michael Cohn. He didn't leave the country. He wasn't out of the country. They had Michael Cohn of the Trump Organization was in Prague. It turned out to be a different Michael Cohn. Sure. It's a disgrace what took place. It's a disgrace. And I think they ought to apologize sure. to start with Michael Cohn. Sir, President since you're attacking us, can you give us a question? President since you're attacking us, can you give us a question? Go since ahead. You're, no, Mr. President-elect. Go, go ahead. Mr. President-elect, since you are attacking no, our news not you. organization, not you. can you give us a chance? Your organization you're, you are attacking our news organization. Your organization Can you give us a chance Let's to go. ask a question, sir? Go ahead. Sir, can Quiet. you state, can, Quiet. Mr. President-elect, go ahead. Can you state categorically, She's asking a question. Don't Mr. Be rude. President elect, can you give us a question? Don't be You're rude. attacking us. Can you give us a question? Don't be rude. No, I'm not going to give you a question. I'm you, not going to give you a can question. You can you state categorically? You are fake news. Sir. Can I help you, sir? Sir, if sir, sir, can I help you? Sir. Shut up. <laughs> go ahead. Can you state categorically that nobody no, Mr. President-elect, that's not appropriate. Mr. President-elect, that's not appropriate. Mr. President-elect, that's not appropriate. Now that's some comedy gold. <laughs> sir, Goodbye. sir, you did not answer. Goodbye. Sir, you did not answer whether any of your associates were in contact with the Russians. Sir, you did not answer. You did not answer whether any of your associates were in contact with the Russians. Can you categorically deny that did not happen, sir? Can you categorically deny that did not happen, sir? <laughs> Just give up, dude. Just give up. <laughs>